friends, hello family, what is going on? My name is Hermes and today I am bringing you a different Pokemon unboxing because today's unboxing is an unboxing. It's the biggest waste of money uh, you could ever spend your money on in Pokemon Universe world. Uh, before we get into it though, I just want to say thank you everyone for watching the videos, leaving a comment, subscribing, uh, liking. Um, I did Pokemon because, I don't know, uh, after Logan Paul's shenanigans and stuff like that, I really, it really like, I guess sparked my interest in Pokemon again. I used to collect Pokemon cards when I was young. Like I had stacks of vintage Pokemon, stacks. And I gave them to my cousins and they threw them away. Um, and. I guess it just really got me down, all that money, all that time spent on collecting Pokemon, it just disappeared and it really got me down in the in the, in the guts, it just, oh, it just got me down. Um, but I don't know, lately I've really been getting back into it, I've been really enjoying it and the support and the views, man, the views, as soon as I hit a Pokemon video and I hit go live, like I check it in like an hour and bang, like views galore. So. If you're new, hit subscribe, hit like, um, and just, yeah, share it with your friends, share it with your friends. If you want to see some specific stuff, let me know. Um, and I just, yeah, I'm really enjoying it. So, uh, hope you guys are too, and if you are, thank you very much. Um, but today, 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 ladies and gentlemen, we have a mystery power cube. Uh, this is the biggest waste of money you will ever spend your money on if you do decide to spend your money on shit like this. Uh, this is from Walmart in America. Most of you know America. Most of you probably know Walmart. Uh, this is a mystery power cube. It is a box that is designed to be uh, taking your money. It's, it's uh, from MJ Holding. I don't know if you can see that. You probably can't. Anyway, it's from MJ Holding. Um, they they give you the fake. They give you the, the the hollow Charizard and Bulbasaur, and you're never gonna get them. You're never gonna get the cards. It is literally a scam. Uh, just so you guys can get a, a widescreen. I fixed everything up for the camera. Um, you're never gonna get any of the stuff that's on that's pictured on the on the car on the box, right? Never gonna happen. But. I thought as a clickbait title, as a, as a funny video to upload, as you can see me waste, literally just throw money down the drain, I thought I would record it. Um, we got to open it, it's got a bit of plastic, I don't have a fancy knife like everybody else does. I will literally got... That'll do. So it comes in plastic. To be honest with you, the most valuable thing about this 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 piece of crap garbage, the most valuable thing about it is the hard container that it comes in. So, what are you supposed to get? Well, that's a, a few thousand dollar card. That's a few thousand dollar card. That's a few thousand dollar card. That's a few thousand. Well, that's tens of thousands. A few thousand, and a few thousand. So. For 50 US, I think these were like 30 US. I paid 40 US, like, like doubled because Pokemon um, and then shipping. And it cost me like 70, 80 bucks Australian. Um, every cube includes 60 common cards. Again, waste of money. And three foil cards or two foil cards plus an EX, GX or a special card. Special card will never be what's pictured. Um, 60 common cards. Uh, if you were to buy them in real life, it's probably worth 60 common cards. Uh, $10, maybe. They're kind of worthless in a way. And the three foil cards aren't foil. Foil generally means hollow. Um, I don't have one to show you. Hollow being um, like that. So, uh, like, I guess I can show you guys here. Like that, where it's got a little shine to the card, but the whole card isn't. Um, that's what, that's what hollow is. Uh, foil is reverse and I've got, uh, I thought I'd have one handy, but I don't have one handy. Um, it doesn't matter. You know what a foil card is, all right? 
So anyway, let's crack into this box. Um, I'm trying to figure out how to open it, but... Oh, I mean, honestly, it is a great container. It is a great, great, great container. Now, I watched a lot of videos on YouTube and I thought, it is never going to happen to me. But they send you a top loader, right? It's in the, the top loader is in the in the, in this. There's nothing in it. It's an empty top loader. Now I don't know why or how that manages to happen, but um, it happens. So these are all the cards. Um. I don't know if they're in any specific order or anything like that, but uh, what we're gonna, I think I, I think I saw a couple of shiny things there, so I'm gonna put them at the back. Um, now, this is a Haunter. Now, you might be going, wait, God, Luke, you got a vintage. See that right there? That's XY. It's a reprint. Palava. We got a Kirillia. We got a Jigglypuff. A Yamask. A Lowland Mouth. Now, to be honest with you, if I got all XY evolutions, I'd, I mean, it's not worth 60 bucks or any, it's not worth any money, but I wouldn't be too peed off about it, but you know it's not going to be, so anyway, Sabrina's Suggestion, Voltorb, Beweasel, it's basically a mega pack opening. Shroomish, and it's not going to be a very long video. Crokinow, see, none of these are... The 2017, I can't remember, I don't know what that logo is, but they're not, um, nothing of any value, if I'm being entirely honest with you. Paris, Ekans, Caterpie, Clefairy, Eevee, actually that one Haunter card. Um, I'm not going to sleeve it or anything, but I am going to like keep it there because I do collect XY cards. Uh, Cubone, Energy, Energy, Brox, Misty's Cerulean, Mantine. Now, I will put on screen now what I actually, because I think we're going to get into the expensive cards coming up. Well, not the expensive, but the, 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 the card. We're going to get into cards. Um, I'm going to put on screen what I paid in AUD now. Right. I don't know where this is going to end up, so it's going to be there. Um, that's how much I paid for it. Um, and then I'm gonna put on, uh, you can't sell, these cards are worth cents, literal cents, uh, in America and in Australia, uh, they are worth cents, so, um, I, I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the values of the, uh, of the, ho of the somewhat expensive cards that we get. So, Kirillia, Golette. Pillow Swine. Alright, so. A Zekrom from 2013. Ooh. You're going to see the value here. But that's not bad. A uh, Claw Itza Hollow from 2014. We're getting even older. That's not bad. And a reverse sea king. Oh god, we, we got Whoa! Pikachu EX promo from 2016. I don't think we're supposed to get that many cards. Execute, Mincino, Numel, Swinob, Asalago, uh Kakuna. Cubone, Jigglypuff, Chimmy, Chimmy, Chimacho, Spoink, Swablu, Energy, Energy, Misty's Determination, I think that's it. Pokemon Center, we got a Magikarp, yo, we got a Drowsy, we got a Magnemite, we got a Ponyta, we got a Sandshrew, we got a Vulpix, and we got a Nidorino. So, if I'm being entirely honest with you, these cards 
uh, I'm wrapped about. They're all uh, XY packs, so they're not really worth... I'm collecting them just because it's a base set reprint. Um, but they're all a base set reprint, right? Um, but I'm collecting them, nether I'm nether nevertheless, I am collecting them. Now, I wasn't supposed to get these. I don't know why, you're not supposed, you're only supposed to get three. So that's what I should have got. All right, I'm gonna zoom out a little bit. So that's what I should have got. Actually, no, I'm not gonna zoom out. That's what I should have got, but I didn't. I got four. I did really well. Considering what I've seen people get where they'll get like a reverse, only they'll just get a reverse. Like I did really well. And these are a somewhat, I mean, almost 10 years old. They're going to have some value. Did I get my money back? You'll find out on the screen. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to come straight back after I check the value of these cards. Because then I can explain it a little bit more. Okay, so I looked them up. Um, surprisingly, uh, there is potentially some value there. Uh, not not a lot. Not, not, not enough to make your money back. But this Pikachu right here... Um, 15 to 20 dollars. I saw one sell for as much as 50 dollars. Um, you won't get 50 dollars for it now. Um, you might get 15 to 20 dollars for it now, still. Um, but that's, I wasn't expecting that at all. So that's pretty good. So, uh, that's cool. Uh, Zekrom, uh, I think it's from Steam Siege. I'm not a hundred percent sure. Um, Four dollars, maybe five dollars, if you, if you were lucky. Conditioning of the cards, though, is not bad. It's not horrible. A little bit of uh, I don't even think that's whitening. I think that's just the card. A little bit of whitening there from transport, but that's not bad. The claw, it's uh, the Clawitza. Uh, this card here, the Hollow. Uh, again, another three to four dollars. Not bad, not bad at all. Um, and I didn't even look up the seeking because it's a reverse. It's a reverse rare, but I didn't even bother. I didn't even bother because it's not gonna be worth. It. It's gonna be worth it. It's gonna, if, if it's got some value, it's a couple of dollars. Um, so all in all, say fifteen. Say you got five. Say you got twenty for that. Say you got five for that, that's 25. Say you got five for that, if you got lucky, that's 30. And say you got a couple of bucks for this. That's, that's more than 50% of your money back. You, If you were to sell anything, you'd sell these and get your money back. Not get your money back, you'd sell these because they're a base set reprint. So they, they, out of everything else that's here, these will hold the, mo the, the most value. None of them, but they're all commons and un uncommon. Yep, yep, yep. And that's a rare. So that's a rare haunter. Not bad. So you could probably sell these base set reprint. Uh, mm, I like over exaggerating at ten dollars. So there's your forty or your fifty dollars, and then all the bulk these common cards that literally nobody wants. I guess, I guess, yes, some of them will have some value to somebody. That value won't be very much. 90% uh, of them are commons or uncommons. Yeah, there might be the occasional rare. But this is bulk. You would, unless you were like a horrible human being, you'd probably sell this, all that bulk for um, maybe, uh, five bucks. So look, honestly, from an investment point of view, um, would I recommend the mystery power cube and see this, they even gave me one. Like I got, I got really lucky. You're not supposed to get what I got. Um, I got really lucky. Um, and, and I didn't really make my money back.
Oops. And the top loader has been squished for that long that um, I think it might be, you know, it's not damaging the card, but it needs to be loosened up a little bit, I reckon. Um, would you buy it? No, I don't think MJ Holding even make them anymore. Um, I got lucky, I guess the person that sold it to me probably should have opened it. Because I've seen videos where people, oh, you know what, I'm not even going to use it. That is, that is the worst top loader I've ever seen in my life. That is how a top loader is su supposed to work, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I got lucky. Uh, to put it put, put it below, I got very lucky. Um, so, would I recommend buying it? No. If you live in Australia, definitely no. Do not even go near it. If you live in the US and you can get one for like on eBay for like twenty bucks, go for it. I've seen again. I've seen uh, a lot of people, a lot of American YouTubers upload their videos of them opening this and um, they got nothing. They got ripped. If anything, they got ripped off because they didn't even get the amount of cards. I got very lucky. I'm, ha I'm very happy. I was only supposed to get this or one of these and that, but I got all of it. The best, the only thing that would have made this better is if they put a vintage card in there, but they didn't. So. <laughs> That doesn't matter. But anyway, that's going to end the video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give the video a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.